Good evening all. Good evening. You are welcome to the tutorials with from eternity the school board. Today we'll take a look at chemistry review assignment. Chemistry review assignment four. So we are going to review the assignment given yesterday. So the first question says, a pure solid usually melts A, over a wide range of temperature, B, at a lower temperature than the impure one, C, at the same temperature as the impure one, D, at a higher temperature than the impure one, Martina. This what? Than the what? Impure one. Gift, do you agree with her? You agree with her? Favor, do you agree with them? You agree with them? What do you think? You don't know. Mark, do you agree with them? Kamsi, do you agree with them? Huh? You don't know. Do you agree with them? What's the answer? Do you agree with them? Huh? You don't know. Wow. Let's go back to the question. The question says, a pure solid usually melts A, over a wide range of temperature. B, at a lower temperature than the impure one. C, at the same temperature as the impure one. D, at a higher temperature than impure one. When we did our test of purity, when we talk about the melting point and boiling point, we say that in a, mis a mixture is impure, right? So if, you s if, if there's an impurity in a solid, in, in a liquid, that the liquid will boil at a higher what? Temperature than the what? Than the, not, than, than the pure one. The impure one will boil at what? Higher temperature than the what? Pure one. We call it boiling point elevation. Solutions experience what is called boiling point elevation. Am I communicating? Now, but when you come to solid, when a solid has an impurity, the melting is not even a point, it's a range. It's a what? Range. But the basic thing is that it, it melts at a what? Lower temperature than the what? Impure what? What did I say? A pure solid melts. A pure solid melts A over a wide range of temperature. B at a, at a lower temperature than the impure one. C at a temperature higher than the impure one. As it as in P1, D at a higher temperature than the what? In P1. So if there's impurity, the, the melting point will do what? Decrease. Okay? The melting point will do what? Decrease. So because the melting point decreases in when there's impurity, that implies that a pure, a pure solid melts at what? A higher what? Temperature than the what? Impure. This is the answer. You are correct. Who said that? Who said the, the first? Okay. Good. You are correct. All right. Number two says, use the diagram below to answer questions two and three. Here is the diagram. Okay. You all have diagram now, right? So no, no, no need drawing it on the board again. You have the diagram. What's that? You don't have the diagram. Huh? You didn't come. Why didn't you come in today? Huh? Huh? I did not come. <laughs> I know what. I don't even know what you did yesterday, sir. You say you came here by four. You didn't see anybody yet. How come? Unless you came by three, thinking that you came by four. 
When did, when, when did you open this place? Who was the first person that came here? When we were not for just few, few minutes after four. You say you came here by four, you didn't see anybody. Maybe you are you are you are you are you are watched this deceived you. Maybe you came by three, they think that you came by four. Actually, three after three, this place was locked. It's possible you, you came by three without knowing. Four. Five after four. I have I had only I had already opened this place. Five after four. So how come? Anyway, let me draw some. Let me draw on board for the for the benefit of those that we are not there. So we, so we can understand what, up, what so we can understand what they're talking about. Okay, as you can see on the board, this is a plot of temperature in degrees Celsius on the x y axis and the time in minutes on the x axis as you can see this solid goes up like this as the heat is applied temperature is increasing goes like this like this like this like this and end up here so the question is for the diagram Number two says, how long does it take all the solids to melt? A, 6.0 minutes. B, 3.0 minutes. C, 2.5 minutes. And D, 1.0 minutes. Gift, what's the answer? A gift. You're coming. No, you should not be coming. You should not be coming by now. And this assignment to you. You went. You went home with three of us. So you should not be coming by now. You should give me the answer straight. It's not true. Or or did you do it? Did you do it? How many minutes? Three minutes. Okay. How how did you get to three minutes? Explain. Okay, one diagram. So, do you agree with that? So, what was your own take? How? What about in diagram? Go there and, and, and explain what about in diagram. Okay, you, you, you can't explain it. Between what? No, uh, we are told that the arrow that identified the solid from that arrow moved down to after two. Mm. Then that one that has the has no number that is still confined to two. You calculate it and you use your speed. My what? At that, at that uh, two point five to two, that is when the stuff from it turns from solid to liquid. Uh, okay, sit down. Any other? Do you have any, 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 anything to say? Okay. Six point zero minutes. How do you get six point zero minutes? From one to two point five. Yes. Uh huh. Uh, it's what? It's liquid. It's liquid. Yes. Okay. Is that why you, you chose six point zero? Yes. Do you have a do you, do you, do you want to say? Okay. Uh. Uh. Okay. Look up. Let me explain this. You know, as you apply heat, the temperature increases, right? And this time takes the time it moves from one state to another. This is the plot of change of state of a substance. It's known as what? 
Sorry. Remember, remember, remember we discussed something. Watch out. Remember what I told you about Latin la, 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 la heat, right? This is solid. At time zero, we apply heat. As we apply heat, temperature is increasing. Look at it. This is increasing what? Temperature. As time is, is increasing, temperature is what? Increasing. Because of the, the heat we are applying, we apply the heat for a long time. I like to come compete with When we apply the heat for like, this is one second, one minute. This is 0 0.5 what? minutes. Am I competing? Am I, am I, am I competing? So from 0 minutes to 0 0.5 minutes, the, the temperature is increased because you are you apply more heat. Am I competing? Now, when you, when you get to 0 0.5 minutes, the temperature will remain constant. And the temperature will remain constant to even, if you are, even though you are applying heat. From this 0 0.5 minutes, the temperature, the temperature will remain constant. That's why this is like this. And at the point, at the point 2.5, 2.5 minutes, the temperature after after 2.5 minutes, the temperature will start increasing again. Do you know what happened? Do you remember what happened between time 0 0.5 minutes to time 2.5 minutes? Do you know what happened? The heat you apply is not seen as temperature increase. What happens? The heat is used to break the intermolecular what? forces that, that held the solid molecules together. So the, the heat we apply now, that's why the temperature is not increasing. The temperature is constant here. The heat is breaking down, is busy breaking down the what? Forces. And when it's done breaking down the forces, it 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 it, 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 it concluded the breakdown at 2.5 watts. Minutes. What it means is that at 2.5 minutes, it has turned to what? Liquid. I'm not, I'm not complete because it has broken down all the bonds. So after, after 2.5 minutes now, what you are hitting now, after, after 2.5 minutes, is, is liquid. That's why the temperature starts to what? Increasing again. And when the temperature is, when you get to time, 3 minutes, 3 minutes, it took another 2.5, 0.5, meet again to get to to the this the for it to be at this liquid state as as, as you're applying the heat right the temperature will, will increase for just one just 0 0.5 what minutes at the three minutes the, the temperature remain constant because the heat now you apply from three minutes four minutes five minutes to six minutes from Three minutes or six minutes, the heat you apply is latent, we call latent. It will not be read as seen as increased temperature. If, if, if you put thermometer there, of course, that's for us to be able to read the temperature, that's what thermometer. You, 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 the heat you are applying will not be seen and read as temperature increase in the what thermometer because it is used to do what break down the what intermolecular forces that, that still hold the what liquid molecules together. To make it free to become what? Gas. Now, this is called what? Latent heat of what? Vaporization. What is called latent heat of what? Fusion. Am I, am I completing? Now, we still do it as a topic in physics, okay? I'm just trying to explain something. Now, this heat now will remain constant here. The temperature, the temperature will remain constant. I, you know that this time, it is means that. It's the time you, you apply the heat, hope you know. Now, on time six, six minutes, the everything has turned towards vapor. As you are, as you are eating again, it will now become the temperature, the, the, the temperature will start to do what again. Increase. Am I competing? Now, for this explanation, now what do you think should be the time for the Liquid solid to do what to take all the solid to do what melt. We are two point what see it here two point five what seconds. So the answer is what C. Now another question says number twenty no question three says if the gas is cooled if you cool the gas. At what temperature will it start to condense? A, 175 degrees Celsius. B, 250 degrees Celsius. 
C, 125 degrees Celsius. D, 150 degrees Celsius. Remember what he said about condensation. What is condensation? Huh? From gas to what? Liquid. Now, from here, look at it here now. He says, at what? He said, at what temperature, as you cool it, it will change from gas to what? Liquid. At what temperature will it start to do what? Condense. If you cool it here now, if you cool it here, am I communicating? If you cool it here, it will, it will come down to what? Here, right? Am I, am I, am I communicating? Now, it remains constant. This constant here, condensation is taking place here. Hope you know. In the opposite direction. Am I communicating? Here now, condensation is, is taking place. It's, it's changing to what? Liquid. And this what? Temperature. So you trace this, this line to the temperature what? Scale. To the temperature axis, okay? So if you trace this line to the, to the temperature axis, extrapolate it to the temperature axis, well, what is the answer? What is the answer? Is exactly between what? At the, middle, at the middle of the space, between what? 200 and what? 100. So what should it be? Eh? Eh? 120. 150. It's exactly between 120, 200 and what? So it should be what? 150. So the answer is what? 150 degrees Celsius. So number three is what? D, 150. Please, as, I, as we explain this, if you have any question, ask, don't keep quiet, please. Ask question, don't keep quiet. So the answer is what? D. 125, look at it from, from the plots. From the, if you say 125, this is exactly at the middle. Between what? Look at it. One, two, three. There's one, two. It's in between them. Am I communicating? Are they having somewhere here? You can say 125, okay? But it's as the, at the middle here, so it's what? 150. Are we there? Look at it. Just trace this line. It's at the middle. To here, it's 150. Here is what? 150. Okay. Number four. Which of the following substances is a mixture? Which of the following substances is a mixture? A, granulated sugar. B, sea water. C, sodium chloride. D, iron filings. Hmm? What's the answer? Uh, I say, okay, you, you, you are listening. Where are you? I say, I say, which of the following, which of the following substances is a mixture? A, granulated sugar. B, sea water. C, sodium chloride. D, iron filings. Sodium chloride. Mike, could be agree with her? What's the answer? Sea water. You thought what? No, talk, talk. You talk what? Talk, talk. No, no, the down is compound. Compound and mixture are not the same thing. Silver is a compound. Am I complicating? It's not a mixture. A mixture from the name mixture, mix. There are one or two different things that are, that are, that are put together. They're not reacting. They're just there. Am I complicating? So sea water contains a lot of... So there is sugar in sea water as a compound. Then there are other, other things. Other things that are there. Debris and other... Other... Materials that are found in what inside the sea water. So it's not a compound, it's a what? It's a mixture. So the answer is what? Granulated sugar. Granulated sugar is not a mixture, it's a compound. I hope you know. True of us. Sugar is a compound. Sodium chloride is a compound. Iron filings is what? An element. True of us. Because it's just iron. And what? Element. Iron filings is an element. 
So all the other ones are either compound or element. And they are pure. Remember, we should say that compound or element are what? Pure. But a mixture is not what? Pure. So see what I say, mixture. Okay, number five question says, changes in the physical states, changes in the physical states of chemical substance, chemical substance is, is shown of the chemical substance, T. Okay, sorry, sorry. Changes in the physical state of a chemical substance, T, are shown in the screen below. The letters X, Y, and Z respectively represent. Let me let me draw the scheme. See how it looks like. I can agree here, right? Huh? Good. From from diagram on the board, we are told to do what? Find what? X, Y, and what? Z. This is liquid T, solid T, and gaseous what? T. A says sublimation condensation and freezing B says sublimation vaporization and solidification C says freezing condensation and sublimation D says evaporation liquefaction and sublimation what's the answer A A writes this this thing depicts change of state of a substance the substance name is what T. From solid, from solid, from solid, it moved directly to what? Gaseous state. So what is X? Sublimation. Sublimation, right? Then from gas, it moves to what? Liquid. What is Y? Condensation. And from liquid, it moves to what? Solid. What is Z? Freezing. freezing. So if you freeze a liquid, you form what? Solid. Get your water and go and put it in the fridge, deep freezer, under 30 minutes or one hour, say. Through two of us, or more than, it will turn to what? Solid. So why Z is what? Freezing. Okay. So this is just talk talking about change of states or substance T. Any question? Any question? Eh? Huh? Okay, in the absence of any question, we will we'll, we'll end our, okay. From gas to solid. From gas to solid. Yes, yes, yes. Yes. Eh? From gas to solid. Deposition, yes. Thank you. That that that's the name. It is not that come on. Eh, yes, yes, yes. Deposition. Mm. D E P O S I then D D then position. Thank you. Okay. Any, any other question? Huh? All right. So, in the absence of any question, we'll end our chemistry review assignment four here. All right. Thank you very much for your attention. God bless you.